are somewhat correlated based on the fact that they are showing different views of various objects and that is what we want to focus on. Now the fundamental difference between orthographic and isometric is that isometric will give you a three-dimensional view and orthographic will give you different views of the object at viewing the object at 90 degrees. That is the point. We are going to have separate views of the object all at 90 degrees. So for example, in isometric, if this, we should view this object in isometric, we are able now to see the front elevation, we are able to see the end elevation, and also we are able to see the plan. Is that clear? So if this was a box, if this was a box, in isometric, we are able to see We are able to see the front elevation, end elevation, and also the plan. However, in orthographic, we are expected now to stand in different positions all viewing this object at 90 degrees. So in a sense, from above looking down, we are all able to see the plan. From the front looking directly ahead, we are able to see the front elevation. And if you should stand to either of the sides, you are able to see what is called the end elevation. So you have a left end elevation from the left side and a right end elevation from the right side. Is that clear? 